Hi, Jill here at Fired Glass again, and today we're going to talk about setting up for a slump on a wave mould. So um, this is my wave mould here, and this is the piece um, that I want to slump. Now, the question we often get about this is um, how do you set it up to stop the piece sliding into the mould? So what do I mean by that? Well, if I put my mould flat on the kiln shelf like this and um, I got that to slump, quite often what happens, especially on longer pieces, what happens is that this slides down here and you end up, once that slumps over this end, with a flat piece on the end. And as I said, it normally happens with longer pieces because typically you will measure into the dip and over the curve and your piece tends to be longer than the mould. So we end up with that problem. To combat that, it's quite easy. You need to get yourself some kiln furniture. So I've got some kiln furniture here. This is a kiln prop um, and this is a piece of kiln dam that we've just cut um, to go onto the top of there. So the height that that gives me is around six centimetres, which is just over two and a quarter inches height and it raises the end or it will raise the end once I put it on top. So just pop that there for a second. So it's, um, it's dead simple. Obviously I would fill this kiln with things to slump. Um, I'm just putting this together in the middle so that you can see clearly um, what I'm doing here. So you simply put that on there, create yourself something that resembles a bit of a ski slope. So make sure that that end is squarely on there, it's not going to go anywhere. And then you can take your piece and you can pop the end. So I line the bottom up with the bottom of the mould. This bit's going to hold this in place. So the gravity obviously, um, normally, as I say, if it was flat, it would want to um, slide down the mould, but gravity is going to stop it doing that. It's going to slump into the curve and it's then going to nicely um, slump over the hump of that mould. So there we go. If you've got a longer one, as I said, maybe two of these together, but this works for me and it's all set up and it's good to go for a slump now.